I honestly had no intentions of actually filming today. But we got nine orders in one day. I mean, it's not big money, $137.50. But still, nine orders in one day? For me, that's good. And I partly want to attribute this, attribute, attribute this. How do you how do you say that word properly? I want to say it's partially thanks to Dixon's Pickens because I was in his like live stream. He does one. I don't even know when he does. I kind of honestly just catch it when I can. But I was in his live stream the other day and he was talking about how people should be getting ready for Q4. I sold San Andreas for the PS3 for $14.90 plus shipping. Honestly, I didn't even know San Andreas came out for the PS3. And I got this game as part of a massive, like y'all, this is one of the largest hauls I've gotten in a very long time. The video's not out yet on the main channel, but it will be next week. It's gonna be a doozy. So he was talking about prepping for Q4 and stuff like that. So I asked like, yo, are you gonna increase the amount that you list for q4 and then he was like me personally no i already list like 50 to 80 items a day something like that but if that's what you want to do then you should start now because if you wait until q4 actually gets here you're going to be kind of behind the curve a little bit i sold uh 007 quantum of solace uh for how much uh 790 plus shipping and this came with i think this actually came with san andreas a lot of these sales that i had literally i just listed like last night so he was saying how you should start now, basically prep for Q4 right now. Now I've been reselling since October of 2022. So I got like thrown into Q4 and I know it gets crazy. I usually list 10 items a night, but I decided for Q4, I'm going to up it to 15. And that's exactly what I did last night. I'm just honestly shocked how fast that turnaround was. I mean, the game's, oh, I I'm always dropping something. I sold Jack X Combat Racing for $3.90 plus shipping. I forgot what I was saying, honestly. Me dropping that game just boggled my brain. But anyways, I'm listing 15 items a day right now, prepping for Q4, and I, I can't believe... Oh, that's what I was saying. Yeah, the turnaround. It happened so fast. Like, I literally just listed these last night, and like... The, the, let me show you this is the pile of games that i listed last night and i haven't had the chance to put them away yet and just dance 2015 sold for 390 plus shipping and you know as dixon's pickens was talking he was saying how he scaled like he would start off at 10 listing 10 items a day then he moved to 20 items a day and then eventually he moved now he's at like 50 listing 50 items a day and i'm just thinking as somebody that sells video games and kind of dabbles in other electronics and stuff like that is it possible for me to scale up that high? Like the biggest video game resellers that like everybody knows, I guess at this point is, is Chase the Right Price, Retro Rick, and, and Phoenix Resale. Where is this game that I sold? You know what? It might, I might not have put it away yet. Um, But yeah, so those are the biggest three. Nope, I didn't put it away yet. I sold Minecraft for PS3 for $9.90 plus shipping. This is, all these games here are all part of that video, that mystery video that I haven't released on the main channel yet. But yeah, so that got me thinking like, in order for me to scale, I'm gonna have to start looking for video game opportunities that don't give me like the max out on profit. Cause I noticed these dudes sell a lot of just like regular bread and butter games. And now don't get me wrong, y'all know I love my Call of Duties, but I have this section of video games over here that I never had any intention on listing because I mean, they're crap titles if I'm being honest, dude, Ark? You can't even find... If you try to, like, look for this game on eBay, I guess people sell their Ark accounts or something like that, but Ark doesn't even show up. I don't know what it is about this game, like, what they're selling, but look up Ark on eBay and try to find the game. It's so difficult. And look how many copies I have of this stupid game, Connect Adventures. We got four there, one there. I saw one. Yeah, we got another one up over here. Like, bro, who, do people want these games? And, like, I've definitely talked about it before, but I really need to actually sit down and try to see if I can get myself involved in um amazon fba because i mentioned this before people over there selling sports games for like 10 15 dollars like bruh how are you doing that how who's buying that i sold road rashed three or no road i, I keep calling it road rashed but it's just road rash 3d not road rashed road rash you know what? I sold this for $2.90 plus shipping. Like right now, I'm making really decent money off of reselling, but I would genuinely like to scale it and make it. Oh my goodness. Okay. I mean, I didn't drop anything per se, but we definitely have some. Oh gosh. Okay. Now I dropped something. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, we have some major spillage and a drop. We've also made a drop. But uh, I sold extra innings for the Super Nintendo for a $9.90 plus shipping. It, it's, it doesn't fail. It never fails. I always drop. I think every single like what sold video that I've made, I've always managed to drop something. And to be fair, I got a pretty crappy inventory. Well, no, no, no. I think my inventory, I can find everything. I don't need to skew anything. I can find it all, you know? You see, it goes from PlayStation, the Xbox, Xbox 360, down to Wii, PS3, and then comes up over here, PS3, PS4. Basically, the cases go from big to small, and I start off with PS2 because, well, I am I used to be a PS2 fanboy. And then everything is in ABC order, relatively. Like, the Z, the numbers go first, and then you have the A, and then just the C's and G's. And like, my inventory says, is good i know what's going on it's just cluttered and, and crowded which means eventually we're going to get to a point where i'm really going to need to like grow my space like actually get a what is, what is it? a storage unit or something like that a barn nah we're not there yet and i think the next game that sold is in here super yep there it goes super another game just listed it last night didn't get a chance to put it away i sold super mario galaxy for 690 plus shipping and it's only the game in case and right next to it our last sale of the day is wii sports for the wii obviously because it's it's called wii sports another one that i just listed last night and it already sold so sick dude 15 a day i don't okay i mean i I can only it's only it's the first day so i can't really say too much but like first impressions are right really impressive you feel me oh wait a minute i gotta go meet up with my plug to grab something let's go do that real quick what up this one got the buttons on the back ah <laughs> <laughs> dope last one there didn't have it appreciate you all right thank you all right the package has been acquired and you know what's crazy i'm actually filming this before i pull the orders i thought about doing this while on my way here but anyways here it is the sony walkman what is this the a f w m a f 5 9 this thing is worth like 50 dollars or like 45 plus shipping however you do it i never do free shipping i always charge shipping if something is 20 dollars, i charge 15 dollars plus shipping and so on and so forth just like that but we picked this up for ten dollars for my plug and this is everything that we sold today all nine items plus a pickup oh wait you can kind of see wait you can kind of see the, that's this that's for the main channel it's peaking y'all getting a sneak peek that's on the main channel in about three days time i'm meeting up with some friends and we're gonna go to the swap meet that i'm always talking about but this time i'm actually gonna film it i never do because i don't know i just feel like that it doesn't really vibe with the main channel content, but I feel like that'd be the perfect place to put a video like that here. So with that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one.